Shockwaves were sent through Brainerd's racing community last November when Jed Copham, the co-owner of Brainerd International Raceway, died in a swimming accident in Florida. I mean, it was tragic. It was a great loss for the family, obviously, um, but also for the racing community, BIR, the staff. Um, um, he was certainly beloved by everybody, um, the face of BIR. Jed co-owned BIR with his wife, Christy, and the track will stay in the family as Christy has taken over as the solo owner. She decided fairly quickly that, yeah, that she wanted to do that, and she'd been involved in the day-to-day -day operations anyway from the get-go. She's been out here at all the events and uh, spends a lot of time out here. So, yeah, I think, it, um, um, I think it's going to be a fairly easy transition for her. The 2019 race schedule looks similar to any other season, filled with drag and street races, along with their marquee event in August, the Lucas Oil NHRA Nationals. We'll have great racing all year long. People can expect that. The racers, the racers and the fans and everybody have really shown a lot of support throughout this whole thing um, and excited to get back on the track and get back to, to BAR itself. So, yeah, we're really looking for a good year again, and uh, yeah, it's going to be fun. But the track and the racing community in Brainerd will never forget Jed Copham as BIR plans to honor their former owner, throughout the year. Yeah, we want to keep his legacy alive, obviously. Um, yeah, he poured his heart and soul into this place um, and uh, kind of got it to where he really wanted it. And, and like I said, people have been really supportive. 2018 ended in tragedy for the BIR family, but they are putting their foot back on the gas for 2019. Yeah, we're working hard to get, uh, get ready for the season, and it's going to come fast, and it's going to be a blast. Reporting from Brainerd, Anthony Scott, Lakeland News.